here we come across several types of transmission line first one is the parallel line second one is the twisted tail line third one is the coaxial cable fourth one is the waveguide okay and the last one is the fiber optic cables okay so i will be showing all these uh, parallel line twisted pair line coaxial cable wave guides and fiber optical cables how they look actually okay and we can also see how these parallel cables till now regarding the transmission lines what you have seen you have observed a two poles which are connected with some electrical wires okay and we have seen the relation how these wires between what are the primary constants we have seen capacitance okay resistance inductance conductance okay we have seen several parameters <clears throat> now apart from this all these primary constants are applicable for another wires also meek is we chud dan ki different gunne names okay but you carefully observe once we go through into the topic we can easily um, see these cables these cables are also called as transmission lines which are used in our daily uh, daily routine life okay let's see one by one what are they first let us see a parallel line so this is a parallel line parallel line is a two wire line okay it consists of two wires that are spaced from 2 to 6 inches away okay generally we see the electrical poles right okay so electrical poles will be having several wires connected from one pole to another pole okay if you observe the distance between the electric wires generally they will be having a distance between 2 to 6 inches okay so actually they are they should be spaced between 2 to 6 inches uh, between each each electrical wire or each transmission line okay so these line type of lines are uh mostly used in uh power like you generally see in the roadside cables poles okay all the things and they are also used for telephone lines okay not the lines which you see for in cellular cellular or the smartphones which you are using right now are mostly uh, wireless okay only you can see a cell phone towers and somewhat like that but in the previous days if you consider the landline phones okay for a landline phones they used to keep some huge wires okay wiring system or networking switch uh, system or the switching system which used to operate these all these telephone lines okay so parallel lines can be considered as okay wires okay which are spaced away up to 2 to 6 inches which are used for transmit some energy that can be electrical energy or that can be in the form of some kind of data okay so if you see here let us say uh, let's consider this diagram these parallel lines this is one line or one wire this is another wire okay these two wires are spaced there will be some gap definitely between two wires what is the gap maintained between two uh, parallel wires just now i have said what is the gap maintained 2 to 6 inches yeah generally by default theoretically whenever you are installing some wires okay a electrical or some data kind of wires it need to have a gap between 2 to 6 inches okay such that there won't be any short circuit or exchange of energy from wire to wire okay now let's see the real time image of this particular uh, parallel line okay i will be see see this is a parallel line you might have so many types observed these kind of lines right road side lo unte these are the high high tension poles or the electrical wires okay if you carefully observe there will be lot of wires which will be going through this particular uh, poles okay these are can be considered as also transmission lines which are used for transmitting the energy electrical energy from one point to another point okay so here also if you observe the wires will be very very um, near 
ओके वायर की वायर के मध्य गैप विल बी वेरी मच नियर ओके बट द गैप नीड टू बी मेन्टेन अटलीस्ट टू टू सिक्स इंच बिटवीन वायर टू वायर सच दट देर वोट बी एनी कैंड ऑफ डिस्टर्बेंस और द एक्सचेंज ऑफ एनर्जी और सम सॉर्ट ऑफ लॉस ओके सो इन ऑर्डर टू डू दट मोस्ट ऑफ द केबल्स वाट दे डू इज सपोज इद वायर अम इदक वायर ओके वाट दे विल डू इज इन ऑर्डर टू अवॉइड द कॉन्टैक्ट बिटवीन द वायर सपोज देर इज अूज एयर फ्लोइंग ओके विंडस ओके देर मैट बी चांस ऑफ टचिंग ऑफ ईच एंड एवरी वायर ओके सो वाट दे डू इज दे विल यूज एन इंसुलेटर इंसुलेटर मीन ए रबर कैंड ऑफ थिंग और एन मेटीरियल विच डज नाट पास एलक्ट्रिटी सो अलाको वाट दे विल डू इज दे विल जॉन दीज टू वायर्स सच दट ईवन दो वायर मूव्स okay there won't be any contact of these two wires okay they won't come close because there is a insulator kind of thing in between this particular two wires okay so always whenever they are using for parallel wires for communication and all those things they will see that there will be some sort of gap between the wires either using this kind of insulating uh, products okay such that they will be keeping away or else they will see that at least there will be a gap between each and every wire they will be connecting it differently okay now let's go to the next one see next comes twisted pair cable okay so this twisted pair cable you have already seen this kind of cable okay there will be a single cable if you cut that cable okay there will be lots of so many wires included in that okay so this twisted pair cable consists of two insulated wires twisted together to form a flexible line without using the spaces i will show you how that looks okay so twisted pair of wires are used for transmission lines for low kind of frequencies बैठक चूडा की वैर कू सी लाइक दिश यू कैन सी ए सिंगल वैर ओवर हियर बट इफ यू कट दिस वैर देर विल बी स्म स्म वैर्स विच आर अगेन कंबाइन विथ ए रबर मेटीरियल ओके सरउंडेड बै रबर मेटीरियल ओके सो दिश नथिंग बट ट्विस्टेड पेर केबल ली हाउ दट रियल टाइम इमेज लुक्स चूस तरह टेल मी वेर दट के ईज यूज see this one on the top most you can see a single wire plastic wire okay if you cut that wire there are so many small cables which are again surrounded by a plastic uh, material okay now let's see the third one okay so these twisted pair cables are very very less in cost that's why they are widely used for internet connections okay now let's see the coaxial cable the third transmission line which is majorly used are coaxial cable okay this coaxial cable also used for internet connections as well as several applications i will show you that also so this coaxial cable will be having several layers if you see here okay चूडा की बैठक वैर ऐसी इफ यू कट दट वैर यू विल बी सी सम सार्ट आफ कापर वैंडिंग अगेन इफ यू रिमूव दट कापर वैंडिंग यू कैन सी सम सार्ट आफ सिलर वैंडिंग अगेन इफ यू रिमूव दट सिलर वैंडिंग यू कैन सी सम सार्ट आफ कंडक्टिंग कापर राड ओके सो देर विल बी लॉर्ड्स ऑफ लेयर्स इन दिस पर्टिकुलर को एक्जल केबल ओके सो दिस को एक्जल केबल इज जनरली कवर्ड बै ए प्लास्टिक कवर् और रबर कवर् and there will be having several layers okay this coaxial cable is used for computers as well and i will be showing the real time image adi jarta chusi where it is used let me know okay see this is the coaxial cable you will be having a black plastic wire if you cut that you can see a copper winding kind of thing again if you cut that you can see a copper i mean uh, silver foil kind of material okay if you cut that there will be a plastic material in that you can see a
కాపర్ లిడ్ కైండ్ ఆఫ్ థింగ్ ఆర్ కాపర్ రాడ్ కైండ్ ఆఫ్ థింగ్ ఓకే సో బయటకు చూడడానికి ఒకటే సింగిల్ వైర్ లాగా ఉంటుంది బట్ దేర్ విల్ బి సెవరల్ లేయర్స్ ఇంక్లూడెడ్ ఇన్ ఇట్ ఓకే నౌ టెల్ మీ దిస్ ఈస్ ఆల్సో యూస్డ్ ఇన్ ఇంటర్నెట్ అపార్ట్ ఫ్రమ్ ఇంటర్నెట్ ఇన్ విచ్ ప్లేస్ దిస్ ఈస్ యూస్డ్ ఇన్ వాట్ అప్లికేషన్స్ వైర్ ని జాగ్రత్తగా చూసి చెప్పండి సిఎన్ టెల్ television antenna yeah yes good see this wire is mainly used for internet connection as well as dish tv connections unte kada cable tv or dish tv connections okay for that uh, this cable is majorly used okay uh, such that there will be passage of good quality of picture or video or audio quality huge data transmission can be done using this particular coaxial cable ఎప్పుడైనా గుర్తుపెట్టుకుని కో యాక్జియల్ అంటే మల్టిపుల్ లేయర్స్ మల్టిపుల్ లేయర్స్ ఆఫ్ కేబుల్ ఈజ్ యూజ్ ఫర్ హై డేటా ట్రాన్స్మిషన్ ఓకే సో దిస్ ఈస్ మెయిన్లీ యూజ్ ఫర్ ఆడియో అండ్ వీడియో డేటా ట్రాన్స్మిషన్ ఎక్కడైతే ఆడియో అండ్ వీడియో ఎక్కువ యూజ్ చేస్తామో అక్కడ మనం యూజ్ చేస్తాం ద బెస్ట్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ సార్ అఫ్ కోర్స్ కంప్యూటర్ లో ఆడియో అండ్ వీడియో ఈజ్ యూజ్ అపార్ట్ ఫ్రమ్ దాట్ మోస్ట్లీ వీల్ బి యూజింగ్ ఫర్ టెలికమ్యూనికేషన్ సర్వీసెస్ టీవీస్ ఓకే అండ్ some sort of uh, voice communications etc we will be using wired voice communications etc okay now let's see another one next one comes the wave guides okay wave guides what do you mean by wave guide english term wave guide see there are two words in the wave guide one is wave second one is guide okay wave guides are nothing but which guides the waves what kind of waves waves can also be considered as signals which are used for transmitting the huge data or information okay so whenever you are transmitting huge data or information you need to follow some sort of frequencies suppose you are uh, using some sort of uh, mobile communications let us say okay you are using two cell phones okay i already said in the first class whenever you are using a mobile phones uh, the preferred frequency is 900 to 1800 megahertz 900 megahertz to 1.8 gigahertz okay 1800 megahertz and 1.8 gigahertz and okay okay so whenever you are operating any kind of signal in gigahertz they are considered as microwaves industries in order to do some several applications you need to use microwaves or electromagnetic energy with high power okay in that case you need to use some kind of metallic tubes through which you can transmit microwave energy in the high power and high frequency in a microwave signals air lo kelthe em avutadi అంత హీట్ ప్రొడ్యూస్ చేస్తుంది హీట్ ప్రొడ్యూస్ చేసినప్పుడు ఎయిర్ లో ఇట్ విల్ బి ఫార్మింగ్ ఇన్ టు రేడియేషన్ రేడియేషన్ విల్ లీడ్ టు సెవరల్ టెంపరేచర్ రైజింగ్ టెంపరేచర్ ఆఫ్ ద అట్మాస్ఫియర్ అండ్ దెర్ విల్ బి సెవరల్ ఎఫెక్ట్స్ యాజ్ వెల్ సో ఇన్ ఇండస్ట్రీస్ వెన్ ఎవర్ దే ఆర్ యూజింగ్ ఎలక్ట్రోమాగ్నెటిక్ వేవ్స్ ఆర్ మైక్రోవేవ్స్ విచ్ హెస్ గాట్ హయ్యర్ ఫ్రీక్వెన్సీస్ గ్రేటర్ దెన్ వన్ గీగా హర్ట్స్ ఆర్ టూ గీగా హర్ట్స్ ఓకే అలాంగ్ విత్ హ్యూజ్ పవర్ in order to escape from the heat what they will do is they will use a huge metallic tubes and those tubes are used to transmit our microwave signals or our electromagnetic waves okay through that okay such that these microwaves will be traveling in that particular wave guides i will show you so these wave guides are available in different shapes rectangular circular elliptical shapes lo untai okay so wave guides ante em ledhu it guide the wave what kind of wave electromagnetic wave or microwave rendu okate okay it guide the wave to transmit from one point to another point it metallic tube is a huge tube at one end microwave source is connected and another end some destination is connected so source side nunchi microwaves release chesinappudu wave guides lo travel avutadi okay wave guide lo ne enduku pedutunnamo ante it will be having huge power okay whenever it is having huge power and huge frequencies it will be distributing huge 
హీట్ ఓకే ఆ హీట్ బయటకు వస్తే రేడియేషన్ ఎక్కువ అవుతుంది కాబట్టి మైక్రోవేవ్ వేవ్ గైడ్స్ లో పెట్టి పంపిస్తారు అనమాట ఆ మైక్రోవేవ్ సిగ్నల్స్ ని ఓకే వేర్ వేవ్ గైడ్స్ ఆర్ నథింగ్ బట్ హ్యూజ్ మెటాలిక్ ట్యూబ్స్ విచ్ ఆర్ ట్రాన్స్మిటింగ్ అవర్ మైక్రోవేవ్స్ ఆర్ ఎలక్ట్రో మ్యాగ్నెటిక్ ఎనర్జీ ఫ్రమ్ వన్ పాయింట్ టు అనదర్ పాయింట్ ఓకే నౌ దీస్ వేవ్ గైడ్స్ ఆర్ ఆఫ్ డిఫరెంట్ టైప్స్ రెక్టాంగులర్ షేప్ లో ఉంటాయి సర్క్యులర్ షేప్ లో ఉంటాయి ఎలక్ట్రికల్ షేప్ లో ఉంటాయి ఓకే నౌ లెట్ సి హౌ దీస్ లుక్ ఇన్ రియల్ టైమ్ So this is a rectangular waveguide. You can also see in our college laboratory. Okay. Uh, in future, if you go to uh, college for offline classes, I will take you to the lab and show you those. Okay. So this is a metallic tubes, which looks like a rectangular shape. Okay. One end of this microwave source connect just the room here. And this microwave energy will be traveling through this waveguide inside the waveguide and coming out like this. Okay. other end is connected to some other devices okay so we are using wave guides to pass this particular microwave frequencies or electromagnetic frequencies in order to he avoid heat or radiation okay so these will be available in different shapes this is rectangular wave guide and this is circular wave guide okay is circular shape lo untund anamata okay and this is elliptical wave guide elliptical shape lo untundi okay the most common and popularly used wave guide is rectangular wave guide why because it is friendly in shape and it is very very easy to connect okay so rectangular wave guide among all the wave guides it is very very easy to connect to any kind of device okay compared to the circular as well as elliptical okay these devices fiber optic cable is a wire which transmits light energy okay so they will be using a light energy okay to transmit some sort of data okay so what is the fastest medium from suppose you put some torch light okay so compared to any kind of medium light travels very 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 fast okay so what this uh, what the scientists have or the engineers what they have done is they are using light energy and that light energy is transmitted through a wire okay which we are calling it as optical fiber this one which we are calling it as optical fiber and they are storing some data in in the light such that the data or the information will be traveled within some milliseconds of time okay enta dooram lo unna gaani if at all you are using an optical fiber cable you can transmit huge amount of data using light okay so this is an optical fiber which is made of a uh, fiber material or glass this mainly uses a uh, i mean light uh, as a medium to transmit some sort of data or information with very 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 fast okay